One. Something went wrong with your scepter. Uh, I think the dragonflies were scattered all over. Scattered! Scattered! <laughs>
Masa. Masa? Masa mozzarella? I don't know. Oh, looks like we got a an ice chop. Yeah, I know what it is, Sparks. Thank you very much. A lot of unnecessary dialogue for literally nothing of importance. Like, I know it's technically worth a dragonfly, but still, it's... We don't need all that dialogue, you know? It's just stupid. Ah, yes. This area is what I mean about the thieves. Yeah, they're actually good guys in this game, for whatever weird reason. They've been stealing your eggs for game after game, and then all of a sudden now they're fine? Like, what? Like, why are they here? Even in the Game Boy games, like, there are some good thieves, but they look different. They're not your typical blue egg-stealing thieves. They just straight up made the bad ones the good ones, and then added in these weird red, yellow, orange -ish looking guys. And I don't actually know why. I believe this is Monkey Monastery over here. This is a really weird looking, like, zone. I'm not entirely sure what's going on around here. But I know it's gonna be the thumbnail. This is only like, I think, three cutscenes in this entire game. I think? There might only be two. I don't even know if there's one when you actually get to the boss. Oh yeah, man, this place just looks beautiful, but oh my lord, is it not, uh, running very well, that's for sure. Why are you going ay yi 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 Looks like we need 14 more gems, so I'm hoping all 14 of them are here. Looks like we might get them all here. Man, that snowy mist there, uh, really slows down the game. Also, we're missing five gems, and what's with this slow-moving dragonfly? Sandra. Now we can technically go to this level if we want to right now, but I don't think I want to yet. We need to go and find that one gem we're missing. Which, honestly, at this rate, could be literally anywhere. Could be in this zone, could be in the second zone, could be in the first zone. You know what, let's go and grab this. This should be the very last of the, um... The dragonflies in this world. Now, I don't know how many of them there are up above, or if there are any up above. And uh, luckily that target that one. And then there's this one over here. I think there's Yeah, this one over here, and then I think two in the Jurassic area, I think. Which, by the way, it does get screwed up if you haven't talked to the mouse guy, so I'm kind of glad we spoke to the mouse guy, because he will screw that up. Did we get it? We didn't get it? Are you serious? We flamed it. It even said zero left. This game sometimes, man. Like, the, the, the whole challenge portal things are so stupid. They're not even, like, challenges. They're just like, here, be quick. And uh, hope that you didn't screw up. No, I don't think there was one behind this, so this time we'll grab this one since it's kind of, you know, like, out of the way. We'll grab that one. The fact that you only need four of them once you get to this point is really funny. Also, I don't like how that, like, stopped me. Alright, I'm hoping... I wonder if it would have been better to grab... Okay, I did grab that one. I wonder which one technically, like, what order they expect you to go in from a technical standpoint, but whatever. Okay, we got it. Nice. Now give me my dragonfly there, Sparks, which is... Howie. Howie Mendel. Now, I don't know why that game keeps lagging so badly, but like, it's now happening with like certain random things. It's just, the longer I play this game, the worse it gets. So, I've, and I rebooted it like three or four times because it kept crashing like I mentioned before. So, let's go and see if we can find this last blue gem, I'm assuming. I probably missed it in the secondary, I'm assuming. 
Uh, like, this episode won't really be a lot of new stuff, honestly. It'll be a lot of old stuff. It's mainly just a backtracking episode. I guess I could go and technically try and do that tank mini game again if I really wanted to. So, that's something we can also do, but I don't know if I want to. Also, that's just the... Also, it's really weird that the... the oh, what's with the... It turning into squares when you run on it like that. Um... We could technically go and do that tank mini game again, and we need to go there for the ice breath anyway, so I guess it would make sense to just go and 100% it, because why not? I don't know where this last blue gem could be, because it's a 5, so I'm assuming it's a blue gem. It could be like 5 red gems, or, or 2 green gems and a red gem, but I'm assuming it's a blue gem. This level is pretty difficult, too. There's a mini game there, though, that likes to bug out and make it super easy in terms of, like, one half of the challenge. The challenge itself is still notoriously difficult. But it's not, like... Um, it's really any harder when that one part bugs out, because it just removes one factor, because it's a race on a slide. But half the time, the slide doesn't work properly, or the uh, race doesn't work properly, so it's just the slide challenge anyway. And it's about the same difficulty, because the slide is literally the challenge, not anything else. Really wish we had the ability to track gems right about now, but... Oh, there it is. It was just one blue gem. Nice. Also, how come I didn't do the do-do-do-do? So now we can actually go back to the dojo. Which is over here. Honey Marsh, though. Um... What I don't like is you think you'd be able to finish all the levels in a world, right? But you can't. And it's just silly. It's just, just ridiculous. Also, these pathways are like way too big and just empty. There's like a lot of nothingness. There were supposed to, I think, be 25 plus levels that were scrapped in this game. So this game was supposed to be like quadruple the size of it is now, but due to the directors and stuff of the game not agreeing on anything and everything like that it just became it was it was a mess it just went into production hell essentially we had 265 gems from that nice now we're at exactly 4,000 we're exactly halfway done I'm pretty sure there's 8,000 gems hmm when you're halfway done the game and yeah, that's that's honestly, it just feels really, really short. And, oh my god, are you going to say you did a good job? She said that the last time I was here, and that's just ridiculous. You don't need to say the same thing every time I come back to a level. Also, why does it always switch back into your breath, like fire breath, when you go to a, an area? So yeah, I can freeze him and then charge him to kill him. That's what the ice breath does. Alright, so this was this the tank minigame? No, this wasn't the tank minigame. This is the one that we already completed. But we do need to do... Where is he? I know there's one around here, right? He's right there. So what you need to do is you actually need to freeze these little guys. Um, I said freeze these little guys, right? I think... I thought you were supposed to freeze the little guys. Wait, where'd the other guy go? Oh my god. Wait. Why can't I jump on him? That's supposed to be how you're supposed to do it, but the game is just like, no, vibration effect, bruh. Oh, wait a minute. Am I supposed to wait till he jumps up? Come on, jump. Jump, little doggy, jump. Jump, 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 to jump, jump, to jump. Jump up and get down, buddy. Come on. Yeah, da 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 da, like Spyro's saying. Come on, man. There we go. I don't know why it wouldn't let me jump on him the first couple of times, but. There's your kite there, little dragon boy. Oh yeah, we don't actually need to go up anywhere else. We need to go over this way to the money bag section. So then we can go and do that. And let's see what we got going on here. 
Well, we already know what's going on here. We need... Whoa, what the heck? I've never seen that before, where these, like, actually have to reform themselves. Are you? Let's see if we can freeze you. Why did that break like that? Oh my god, we have to talk to you too? Um, game, you do realize how this is supposed to work, right? You're supposed to let me... Oh my god, the game is broken, my lord. Um, game, you do realize that I'm supposed to jump on them, right? Like, this game is so busted. Come on, man. Like, I'm falling through them now. Like, what the heck is going on here? Ah. <sighs> My effing god. Whoever designed this challenge needs to be murdered. Like, come on, man. Who... Who designed this? Like... I can't jump on any part of them. It just, like, vibrates. Come on, RJ. Let me up, you stupid dragon. Mm-hmm. I'm about to just delete this whole project off the channel because of how stupid this is. Like, get on the dragon, you stupid dragon! Like, what is this? Oh my god, whose bright idea was- like, look at this, it doesn't matter- like, now I'm inside the dragon. Alright guys, I'm just gonna end the episode here, and in the next episode I'll figure out what the frick I'm supposed to do with the fact that these guys just don't work. Because, honest to god, there's nothing I can do about this, and it's the- just- I'm tempted not to get 100% on this game just because of that factor. See you guys next time. Join the Discord link below, Patreon, like the video, you know what to do. Bye-bye.